This was one of those rare performances which should put another 4,000 on Saturday's gate if there's any justice left in football. It was a spectacular home debut for Argyle's new winger, Calvin Plummer, who signalled his intentions with this delightful scissor kick in the first half. But somewhat inevitably, Argyle's first goal came from the outstretched boot of veteran striker Tommy Tynan, after Marker and McCarthy had failed to capitalise on Stoke's defensive panic. But it was Plummer who carved out the second with this classical wing play. The perfect cross into the centre, but what a finish from Tynan. Argyle's third couldn't have been more different, but again it was a goal to incite the passions. Nicky Marker took possession in his own half, and then with a combination of pure strength, skill and a little luck, he rounded Peter Fox to slide the ball home. By this time, Stoke were a broken side and a fourth was only to be expected. John Brimacombe hit the cross into the centre and Tynan pounced with all his old potency to complete a fine hat-trick. But at the final whistle, it was Calvin Plummer who accepted the acclaim of the fans. It looks like he'll be staying at home park. The move can't come soon enough. <laughs>